so to bit of a disappointing night there um, to finish with what's your uh, immediate emotion yeah, a bit of a tough pill to swallow. Um, obviously, um, that's a, um, a game that we, you know, build ourselves up for going into the tournament. Um, I think we showed moments of um, where, where we can be and moments that um, of just lapses in concentration. So we've got a lot to build on. Um, we just had a, a team talk then and, and then said, you know, the, the tournament isn't over. We've got to build, work from that, build, um, build on momentum. So I think you said, you know, straight up going three 0 up first 15-20 uh, minutes. I think, like I said, that shows straight away what the teams, do, what the team can do, what the team's capable. Of. Yeah, de I mean, definitely. Like, uh, you couldn't have asked for a better start to the game. Um, we've just got to work on how we adapt from that, and then also stop the bleeding. Um, you know, a number of goals unanswered there. Um, cost, you know, and ultimately cost us the game. So, how we make stops defensively, and um, how we, cut, uh, you know, cut the bleeding, um, and then also capitalise on momentum on the with this off the field. Is that what a team has to learn throughout a tournament? You know, it sort of practices and practices, but when it comes together, there are things that you just, you know, you have, you have to work out as the tournament goes along. I mean, definitely, like team chemistry. You know, we all play for different clubs um, back home, so building that chemistry um, as part of the process. Like, normally a team gets stronger as they go through the tournament, and we're banking on doing that. Um, obviously, back out representing your country again. On a personal note. Um, how does it feel to get back out there in a world champs with the England shirt? Well, I mean, it's always an honour. Like, um, super, you know, super proud moment for myself, um, and also with a great group of a great group of guys here. So it, it, it just makes it that much better when you've got such a great group. And you know, hopefully, we can do some real big things. Not the result that we wanted tonight, but as I said, we're going to build on that. And having a group like that does that mean you know, move on from this, move on to the game tomorrow, uh, clean slate. Uh, looking uh, forward to that. Yeah, exactly. Like we've got to, you know, rinse ourselves down from that, um, and I think we've got the mentality to do that. Like we've got some real strong characters, and um, we've got a really strong leadership group um, for our captains, um, and you know we're going to be quite strong at it. And ultimately, the way the format of the tournament works is that, you know, the meaningful games come towards the back end, whatever the results are really on. So that's the thing you've got to tell yourself about peaking at the right points. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, this is uh, you know it's almost like a freebie at the start of the, the game. You know, it pay, like sets a, a marker for where you are um, as a team. But ultimately, it's a it's a, you know an opportunity to build on rather than you know doom and gloom at the start where you know other tournaments have been like that. So um, we're we're backfiring for business end.